every Monday and Friday we bring you Tim's Travels. So new this morning, it's time now for another edition of Junk or Gem. A while back, we asked you, our morning show viewers, to submit a picture and information about an item you thought might be of value. And we got quite the response. Last week we featured a football worth $7,500. Will we get a gem again this week? Tim Elliott has the answer. I brought in my Italian vase. Robin Dressel paid $10 for this vivacious vase more than a decade ago. She picked it up at a garage sale in Janesville. I bought it because I liked it. It is a beautiful vase. It's from uh, 1945. It is an Italian vase. Rick from Rick's Old Gold on Willie Street says the vase was made in post-World War II Italy as the country was trying to get back on its feet. This is the novelty piece. Let's reboot our economy and let's make some money. Not a super fine, fine piece. It's still a beautiful piece. It's spectacular. What it does have, it has height and size. But it really wasn't made by the masters, but it's like they were trying to be the masters. And it is worth about $350. A pretty good value considering I only paid $10 for it. I definitely think I'll, I'll hang on to it and probably not keep it around where the kids are. Okay, so the vase, not necessarily a gem according to Rick here at Rick's Old Gold, but not necessarily junk either. We'll let you decide on that one. Up next, a pair of tickets from an historic and controversial sporting event. That was a famous fight. Chris brought in these two tickets from the 1927 heavyweight fight between Jack Dempsey and Gene Tunney. The thing about this particular fight, it's well known for the long count. Tunney goes down for the first time in his career. And controversy ensued. Many believe the ref gave Tunney more than 10 seconds to get back on his feet, making this fight part of boxing lore. Where'd you get these tickets, Chris? The father-in-law had them, and uh, he found them in a wall up in uh, Eau Claire, Wisconsin. The fight took place at Soldier Field in Chicago with more than 100,000 people in attendance. People were excited about their heavyweights. But something unique about these particular tickets, they are unused. The stub is still attached, and that makes them more valuable. Uh, it could go for 1000 to 1200 bucks. For both? Yeah. That's pretty good. You're supposed to For be all, tickets. Are you all excited, Chris? Oh, yeah, it's <laughs> better than the 25. For NBC 15 News, I'm Tim Elliott. And the Schwartz family tells us they found out the family of Jack Dempsey donated the gloves from that fight to the Smithsonian Institute. So they've decided to donate the tickets to the Smithsonian as well. That's, That's wonderful. Class. Very nice.